Hey everyone, welcome to another pack opening with Burt's Boosters. So, this is the left versus right. We'll be doing the right side today, but to go over what we got last time. We got a Neuvern V, a Medicham V, Full Art, a Gyarados V, an Arctivish V. I think I have, I had these three already. And the Neuvern V and then an Entei and a Glaring Moltres Hollow. So, you know, we got four, full, four V pulls. Um... Um, I'm hoping for hoping for another four. That would be nice. But let's put those over there. Oh, whoops, don't want to stay up. Put these over there. Or do I want to put them on the left side so I can maybe put the other ones on the right. Let's get some sleeves out just in case. Now let's get to it. You know what we're looking for. But I'm curious to see who we win. I don't remember who I said we won. I also haven't edited this other video yet, so I don't exactly know how much the left side is worth, but give it you an out of ten. But I will make sure to check down below. I'm trying to remember. I know Arctivish isn't anything crazy. The Gyarados isn't anything crazy. I don't think the Metacham is either. Like I'm trying to remember when I got it. Because I've packed it, I think, in my in the first booster box opening. Torpedo. So, why don't you guys let me know down below how excited you are for uh, Evolving Skies. And um, if you have gotten your hands on anything, let me know if you've... Uh, let me know if you've got anything yet. I'm curious to say, I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos, seeing what people pull. You know, it makes you sad when uh, another Entei Hollow makes you sad when they pack like something just something that you want. You know, I haven't seen too many of the uh, the, the Dragonites. The Dragonite said I want the alt art, the alt, the alt full art. Haven't seen many of those yet, but that's what I'm after. But I'm obviously after the V and V Max Rayquaza alt arts. But I love the secret energy as well. I haven't had one of those yet at all. I got the trainer, which is cool. Oh, we got a pull, and it is Umbreon V. Not bad. I already have this card. I actually think that might be my third one that I've gotten. That's still our first real pull. I don't really include hollows. But they still go for a few bucks every once in a while. I think the end thing goes for legitimately a dollar. Oh, I almost didn't give you guys the code. I like try to like really hold the cards together too because sometimes you could see like the the sparkle from from a, like one of the special cards so I try to really like hold them together and not really look. So basically I'm like not looking at all. When I flip one, two, three, four. And then there's you have to look at the cards, so it's sometimes difficult. Like, I already think we got one, and it's just because... It's also because I use Flash. Yeah, we do. And we have a Garbodor VMAX. First time I pulled this. Very nice card. I guess it's, I guess maybe, like, it's because I have the Flash on. But I think the Flash just makes the cards look better. It adds more color. But it's still a very nice pull. So that's two pulls so far. I'm not even halfway through these packs. I don't know. How does the right side of the pack anyway. So that's at least nice. She does that. Let's get rid of that. A chin chin chair, a pet little bino, a tear so wabafet, and another hollow. Not gonna complain. I think um the only common or uncommon I'm now currently missing is uh Toy Catcher. 
which honestly is really weird that I'm missing a trainer. Uh, I'm missing a trainer uncommon. Oh, whoops. And I honestly haven't even been looking for it in this video so far, so. Maybe I got it, and maybe you guys noticed, but hopefully I get it, because it's the only uncommon or common left that I need, Drowsy. Shifter, and then I think rares are just hollows at this point. I think I need, like, check this one open. I think just, like, five or six rares I need, and then obviously all the big, all the, all the other cards, V-Maxes, Vs, all darts. I need a bunch of those. Strange loop at Kurvana, Mulga, Kong. Love this. Jump Pluff and Flapper. Which I already have. So, we've gotten what? Two pulls on this side, I think? Yeah, right? The Umbreon, which I already have, and the Garbodor V Max, which is still a nice pull. Storm Mountains. I know Story Mounds at one point was going for a decent amount. Don't know if that's still the case. Lucky Ice Pop and Pinza, which I already have. So we got a good amount of packs left. Probably about just over halfway through with this side. Oh, I might have just blocked that off. Sorry about that if I did. Boldor, Loma Lady, Wubad, Simple, Psyduck, Eevee, Beautiful, Beevil, and a Sharpedo. And these Sharpedos, uh, give them a lot. Here's the card, just in case. I didn't get it for you guys. These Sharpedos come in, you know. Very quickly sometimes. A lot. It's, I mean, if only they were worth something, I'd sell them for a lot. Evil again, except not hollow, not reverse hollow. But yeah, so. What I'll do at the end of this video is obviously I'll get you guys the totals and edit it. But I will also. There's the toy catcher. I'm putting that off to the side because I need that. I may have already gotten out of this video, but. I'd also like the golden one. Copycat. Oh, a vapor. I went a little too quick through that one. Vaporeon VMAX, very, very nice. That is a great pull out due to the fact that I don't have it. I believe the... I don't want to... I think the best one to get... I don't think the Vaporeon goes for really anything. Oh, no, it does, actually, so I'm going to... That is actually worthy. I know some people do it differently uh, than me. Like, if you watch a lot of people do it, um, they usually only will top load, you know, like the, sheet, like the big poles, like, you know, they, eh, that's good. They will only top load, you know, like um, the, like the big Rayquaza cards. Things that are like are crazy expensive, um, and I get that if you're kind of like a huge collector, or you're like kind of opening a bunch of packs. But for me, it's kind of you know anything that's like pretty big. That's what we're right in the middle now. Anything that's pretty big, and I can tell we have something. And I'm, Flaffy used to go for a lot, so I'm gonna put that there. Um, that goes for like anything over ten. I usually care about. I think I saw partly what this card is already. It's gold. Oh, baby, come on. A Cressilia. Oh, man. That is a huge pull. A Cressilia secret. Oh, man. Secret rare card. That is just gorgeous. Now, I'm also not big into rating and stuff, but that looks pretty good. The right side might be a little bit bigger. Like, I feel like you can see it more on this side. The right side looks a little thicker, but... This has been a great, great right side. I'm, you know, I didn't even look into the left side, but I don't have to 
because the right side definitely takes the win here. Although not one of the most expensive cards, it's still one of the cards I really wanted. Oh, man. And that card is currently selling for just over $40. Did I look it up right away? <laughs> But yeah, so I, hey, you know what? This side has been very good to me. So I'm happy with this back of me already. Don't even really need anything else. I just realized that I have those cards sitting there. But Tentacool and Seismitoad. Seismitoad's another one of those that I always get. I guess that makes sense though, because normal rares are kind of more common. But yeah, I also plan on... Uh, if I don't get that Dragonite, I plan on getting it. I plan on buying it. But I, I mean, I'm hoping that that's not an issue with the amount of stuff I have coming in. And the amount of stuff I'm still going to continue to get. Yeah, back to back cuter flies. And I'm going to flap one again. But I mean, what? I mean, these two alone. Great. I mean, this one. I fuck. Oh, secret rares are just gorgeous. I'm still looking for my fridge. Rayquaza, Rayquaza, I heard it a million different ways. I like to say Rayquaza. But. Still looking for my first one of him. I haven't gotten any yet. Which this will be my third. My third. So this is the last pack and this will make it three booster boxes open. Three booster boxes open. The last, the one that I did yesterday that's going live actually in like 15 minutes. Um, that one was pretty brutal, I gotta say. Wasn't a gr I got one really good pull, so it's like kind of made up for it, but um, it like, you know, I only got five hits, but still recommend watching it because it kind of puts it in perspective that it's not always going to be a banger. And a Miltic. So we don't end off with a bang, but needless to say, right side is taking the dub for sure. So let's see what we. So right side got an Entei, an Umbreon V, a Garbodor V Max, Florius Hollow. But then the two big pulls were obviously the Vaporeon V Max and the Cresselia Secret Rare. Both cards I don't have. But yeah, so, if you picked the right side, congrats, you were right. Haha, <laughs> if you picked the right side, you were right. Look at that. But, yeah. And I also got Tori Kenji, which I needed. So, and some more hollows and rares. So, if you guys uh, liked the video, please make sure to give it a like down below. Leave some comments on any other videos, you, ideas you guys have, or videos you'd like to see. I still got so much content to come out. I got a lot of stuff uh, still to open. I got booster box coming in still um so yeah like i said like comment subscribe and i'm out peace